Hello everyone and welcome back to another live stream tutorial or actually I had a tutorial here on this beautiful heart braided hairstyle and if you're curious to achieve for Valentine's Day then definitely check out Save Me From USA's um, YouTube channel where you can actually watch how I accomplished this hairstyle in under 10 minutes and we did this live so if you have any questions of course you can um, drop them in the comments on YouTube I'd be happy to um, answer those so you can achieve this super cute easy simple hairstyle for Valentine's Day but in today's live stream we are going to discuss what is Ayurveda and how that really pertains to hair health and many of us know that there's a lot of different hair types there's a lot of different hair textures and a lot of different hair concerns and that's really where um, our treatment collection comes into play because a lot of us have different signs of hair damage and also sources of hair damage depending on maybe where we're living maybe we're exposed to more sun this is our protection um, against uv damage as well as mineral um, minerals that deposit on the hair from hard water um, all of these can really actually coat the hair and cause a lot of damage um, if we are not protecting our hair some of us may go through a lot of chemical processing, myself included. Um, I do a lot of color treating, highlights, all of that. Um, thank you so much. Uh, yes, best for Valentine's Day. And so um, chemicals can really deplete the hair of essential protein and moisture. It really gives the hair a rough texture, but it's also really brittle and then therefore prone to breakage because of the fact that the proteins and that structure um, within the hair are compromised every time we're color treating. But also the same thing goes from when our heat styling, even if we're using a heat protectant, the hair starts to lose moisture, especially when we're excessively heat styling our hair. Um, but then also from, you know, just excessive heat styling, it also can break um, the hydroelastic bonds. So these are really important to use a bond building formulation as well. We've heard of Olaplex and how this helps to build bonds into the hair. Our treatment collection is very similar to that. Um, however, we're really concentrated formulas. So you are the one who gets to determine how you want to dilute it. And so that's where we really come into play on how we really fit into um, your hair care regimen, but also for all hair types as well. Um, so after all, hair is really one of the most prominent aspects of our appearance, just like our skin, and we're really investing in our skincare and these active ingredients that are really helping to benefit our skin. The same thing goes with our hair. And our founder, April Peck, she founded the renowned skincare company Hydropeptide and noticed that there was a void in the market of hair care when it came to utilizing skin-worthy actives such as hyaluronic acid, marine extract as well. Well, there's all these different ingredients that are formulated into each of these formulas that are really going to help improve hydration, strength into the hair, as well as thickness and fullness in the hair. There are so many different benefits that you will see in this treatment collection in just three uses. We have clinical studies to prove every single one of them. And really given the amount of choices that we have when it comes to hair care products, many of us, you know, wouldn't have healthy, lustrous hair um, you know, if it wasn't for having these really great active ingredients. And so myself included was using a lot of silicone products that were just kind of coating my hair and really just kind of making my hair feel silky and soft to the touch. But really when it came to um, the texture, you know, changes in the, um, you know, type of hydration I had in my hair, there was really no signs of improvement. And I have to say, ever since I've been using Save Me From concentrated treatments that I've really seen just such an incredible improvement in just the amount of maybe six months I've been using the products, I've just been so amazed by how, um, how revolutionary these hair products really are. But the problem is that also with a lot of hair care products is that there's a lot of chemicals, there's fragrances, and there's also can be chemicals that can be harmful to some of us who are really looking to grow our hair. Um, and this can really have a detrimental impact on, um, of course, not only the hair, but also just the environment as well. Um, and this is where Ayurveda really kind of comes into play is really having a holistic um, balance approach to um, the health and you know, of our bodies, but also 
with save me from taking that into account the um, health of hair and really using um, specific ingredients to help um, with sources of hair damage that's depleted of these critical and essential nutrients to keep hair strong, healthy, and really vibrant as a result. So, um, you know, many of us just are using hair products that are really just um, helping to treat hair superficially by using silicones to coat the hair. And so with our treatments, um, these are all clinically proven to really get to the, um, to the source and to the root of your hair damage quite literally. And that's another thing is that we take a balanced approach with all these ingredients. So depending on really what your hair needs at that given moment, your hair will be restored of those critical nutrients to help just promote stronger, healthier hair. Um, and the Ayurvedic approach is similar to that of our um, hair care collection. And so we are inspired by Ayurveda um, by really having um, you know, more natural ingredients. Um, we also do not use um, artificial type of scents. If so, it's less than 1% is added. Um, so it's very important to understand that like a lot of fragrances um, you have kind of trained us as consumers, um, but they're really not helpful ingredients for the hair. Think of them as really kind of being a filler ingredient. Um, and so for some of us, you know, natural hair care is really important and it's really great to see the shift in cleaner beauty products um, because of course, you know, taking a more holistic balanced approach to our hair care can really yield incredible benefits. And especially when we're consistent, like we are with our skincare. Um, the Ayurvedic tradition is really intrinsically holistic. So whether, you know, you were choosing a topical treatment like Save Me From or just a more systematic approach, um, you know, with maybe changing up your diet, um, these really can help address the root um, and the causes of maybe your hair concerns um, as well as health concerns as well. Um, so I'm just going to do a, like a brief overview of Ayurveda and how it really relates to hair. Um, the foundational principles of Ayurveda is the um, really like the digestive system, which really kind of um, our diet really determines the quality of nourishment that our body really receives um, from really selecting whole um, foods and really supplying our, you know, body with these really important ingredients. And the same thing goes for our hair diet, having a well-balanced um very um, nourishing diet is really critical for our hair as well as our digestive um, health as well. Um, and so with that said, that's another thing that we've kind of taken here at Save Me From is really having um, these great ingredients such as the fenugreek seed, which is actually commonly used in Ayurveda. Um, so this is Ayurvedic fenugreek and we've actually infused that into every single one of our treatments and through an extraction technology called Fenugen. Um, and this yields five times more potency in those plant nutrients, those phytochemicals that are really beneficial to not only the health of our hair, but also to the scalp as well. So really having um, a multifunctional product is really important to our founder um, for really helping to not only promote healthier hair, but also through the scalp as well. Um, and despite being, um, you know, our Ayurveda is 5,000 years old, it has a quite impressive amount of, um, you know, treatment strategies strategies for really optimizing our health, um, which many of these treatments are still relevant to this day. Um, so here we're going to just kind of talk about this Ayurvedic approach um, and really how this approach that we have been inspired by is really going to yield, um, you know, an optimization of hair and scalp health, um, improving the strength, the density, um, fullness, and the luster of hair um, as well. So, um, a lot of times we, I'll talk about the hair types that we commonly hear, you know, that we're familiar with. There's, um, thin and kind of finer hair, which typically, um, you have fewer hairs like on the hair strand. And when we're aging, we start to see, um, a lot of thinning and, um, kind of a lack of fullness to the hair. And that really is just attributed to the aging process of hair. Um, the diameter of the hair strand starts to get smaller and thinner. Um, but some of us also may find ourselves um, identifying with a thick uh, hair kind of texture or type, which is a more fuller, denser um, hair strand. So these are really, um, you know, kind of the different 
aspects and also coarse as well can be um you know determined that that kind of strand of hair is really um thicker and broader than that of like a finer hair texture as well um and so the ayurvedic approach to hair is when it's healthy it really reflects um this unique ratio of um all of these different um kind of like energies i guess i could say is veda um pita and kappa um, which these are kind of like these doshas, um, which are commonly, you know, known as like a characteristic of like our, um, certain like Ayurvedic kind of, um, system that we can then target. So when we have these different, not go into them a little bit more, um, to use these approaches with a specific regimen and ingredients to help, um, address that. And these are, um, kind of considered dosha characteristics. Um, so I'll go over kind of like the different types of, um, Ayurvedic kind of doshas here. Um, they're like hair types. So there is a, Beta hair type, um, which is relatively thin hair, but it also is a little thicker, so of a coarser texture. Um, the hair kind of texture can be, of course, straight, curly, a combination, wavy. Um, it can grow quickly, but it's a little bit unruly. So if you identify with this type of hair type, this is the Veda type of hair in Ayurvedic hair types. There's also pita type hair, which is typically soft. It's also straight. It's not really unmanageable. It's pretty predictable. Um, it has kind of a moderate thickness, but it also is very fine as well. And then there's the healthy kappa type, which is wavy, lustrous, full, strong, coarse, and thick. Um, so depending on really where you see yourself fitting into that, that's really where this Ayurveda kind of um, hair care regimen is really coming into play. Um, so we are, of course, you know, are not purely Ayurvedic. We are Ayurvedic inspired. Um, so really taking into account, you know, of course, the different elements of hair that can be, um, of course, damaged as a result from our lifestyle or where we're living or just really the mechanical styling. So if we're combing our hair when it's wet, we can actually have breakage or really heat styling our hair. It really just depends on really the lifestyle to really address the hair concerns that you may have. And if the health of your hair is currently compromised, um, it's really important to assess your natural hair type based on lifelong patterns and really your lifestyle. And the Ayurvedic approach is not really trying to alter the fundamentals like of your hair, but rather inviting it to be its absolute best. So just like with our diets, nutrition is key. And especially too, when it comes to healthy hair, topicals are not going to be the end all solution to um, your hair health. Of course, um, healthy hair roots from a healthy scalp. And so that's what's so wonderful about the fenugreek seed is that it has really great proteins and lipids and vitamins and antioxidants that really are working to replenish the scalp with hydration. So if you have a flaky, dry scalp, but also have antimicrobial properties as well. So that is really helping with any sort of flakiness and irritation to the scalp um, as well. Um, so this is an important distinction because our culture really tends to regard healthy hair um, to this kappa type of hair, which is really that, you know, wavy, thick, and just healthy hair. Um, but many of us develop the idea that this natural hair type is, you know, inadequate from what we were just reading. Um, so a lot of us can really benefit from these rich um, kind of Ayurvedic hair rituals that women still practice in India um, to this day. And our founder really, um, her journey to really learn more about the world's healthiest hair took her to India. Um, and that's where we found out about these um, Ayurvedic kind of hair practices and rituals. Then we modernized it into a really super powered and charged technology to really help restore um, shine, hydration, strength into the hair as well. And imbalances can really do a major effect or a detriment to the hair um, when it comes to the strength and appearance um, of our hair health. Um, so following, you know, different doshas, um, you know, in Ayurveda can really help with that. Um, of course, you know, diet is critical. So being sure to also make an improvement in our diet is really going to yield a great result for our hair. Um, and it's 
to be said too in Ayurveda that excess Veda can cause hair to be dry, um, frizzy and brittle and really just lack luster as a result. And that can be from attributed from where we're living. So these things are beyond our control. Um, so some of us might be living in an environment where there's a lot of hard water um, deposits into the water, um, but also chemicals can really strip hair of moisture and those proteins, uh, heat styling, and also thinning. So things that are kind of beyond our control um, can actually cause, you know, hair to thin or can uh, cause hair fall. Um, and of course, you know, breakage, which makes the hair shorter and more difficult to grow as a result and then split ends. So each and every single one of these treatments are working to address those specific concerns. If you're worried about hair thinning, um, we have an increase of thickness in just three uses at 203%. Um, the split ends reduced at 97%. Um, and just those three uses increase in hydration and just three uses, 201%. Um, so these are really great um, for just helping to uh, attack any sort of that premature aging or damage, um, while also offering some of that defense as well. Um, so we talked about excess VEDA. So there's excess PETA, which actually can cause heat um, in the hair follicles. So that can actually cause damage to the hair as a result and can lead to that premature um, graying and thinning as I was talking about. Um, this is a great formula to help address that. We have a lot of ceramides in this formulation, antioxidants, and then also proteins to really help build strength and also improve thickness in hair. Um, fenugreek, since that is also infused in this, um, is also known to help increase hair thickness. There's a lot of fiber in the fenugreek, so it really actually kind of coats the hair strand and really helps um, the appearance of thicker and fuller hair. So, um, of course, we hear this a lot from our customers um, or just people who are looking at our products. How can I help, you know, my fine, flat hair? Um, what is something, a solution that you have to recommend? And I highly recommend with our clinically proven um, just three uses, 203% increase in that hair thickness. You will see such an incredible result. Um, and it's really great for fine hair. It's not going to really coat the hair strand um, and really make your hair weigh down as a result. It's really just a lightweight, seamless uh, treatment that is not only helping to reverse the signs of damage and aging to hair, but also help offer defense and protection against any sort of further damage and occurring. Hello, hola. Thank you for joining. Um, so really the excess, I talked about excess PETA and also excess VEDA, excess kappa really causes excessive oiliness, um, heaviness um, onto the hair as well. So it, when these different um, VEDAs are really um, out or doshas, I should say, are out of balance. And that is really when we're starting to see some of these different hair problems and concerns. So they can be attributed from a lot of different sources as well. Um, and so what's really important is that we're taking a holistic approach to not only our hair care, but also just our diet and our system, really making sure to utilize um, these really rich foods and antioxidants and also ingredients with antioxidants and powerful active ingredients that we see in skincare, but never in hair care, um, really utilizing these really natural ingredients. And that's really where um, Ayurveda comes into play. They are more of an herb, um, you know, herbal kind of approach to helping with your hair, a more natural approach to offer um, deep replenishment and nourishment at really that um, cellular level in the body, but also in the hair strand as well. Um, so Ayurveda is really just a approach to, um, holistic, you know, medicine, alternative medicine. Um, so for those of you who are really intrigued by um, Ayurveda, I definitely encourage you to check out our blogs um, where we talk about how Ayurvedic um, hair, you know, herbs and also fenugreek are really beneficial for hair um, as results. So um, we have fenugreek, we have karanja oil in all of our treatments as well. These are really commonly used um, in Ayurvedic kind of hair care products. Um, but if you're curious to learn a little bit more about how Ayurveda translates into Save Me From, then definitely check out our next live stream 
um, where we are going to go live on Instagram and answer any of your questions um, in real time to address the hair concerns that you may have, um, and especially to work in balance with your current hair care regimen, but also to help treat your hair concerns as well. Um, so really taking a systematic approach to not only our diet, but also to the hair treatments for hair is really going to improve the overall um, health and appearance um, of the hair as well. Um, so nourishing your hair with your diets and also with a very concentrated hair treatment, I would believe are going to be the best benefits for your hair um, as well. So thank you so much to everyone who tuned in on this live stream and I will see you on the next one.